Hello everyone, and I cannot begin to tell you how much torture I've been through to get to this. It is steaming hot in this basement. I filmed this whole video and then fucked it up. So here I am again, filming again just for you. So here you go. The do's and the don'ts of basic conversation. Can you not leave your house without fucking up? Can you not talk to people without fucking up? Don't go to school without this. Don't go to work without this. Don't go anywhere without this. Just listen, the do's and the don'ts. I made a little list. It kind of says where I live on it, so I'm gonna cover it up like that. Here are the do's and the don'ts. First thing that people should not talk about in public are video games. I'm sorry, I know, you love video games too bad, too bad. People are sitting behind me on the bus and they're like, oh my god, it's the world of Warcraft. No, stop talking about that, you sound like freak, you sound like freak. Okay, the second thing that you don't want to talk about is your animals. I'm sorry, I know, you love them, they're cute, they're fuzzy, they're- Don't talk about them in public. Unless you're like having a conversation. Oh, okay, let me get into detail. We're gonna take a little test. I know, we're in school now, right? We're in school. You're gonna take a little public social test, like a- like a social, not a social studies test. Fuck social studies. You're not taking a social studies test. You're taking a social conversation test. You're taking a conversation test. Okay. When you're sitting, you're trying to get to know someone. Okay. You're sitting down with them. You're having a conversation. And here are some three scenarios. I'm going to put you through. I'm going to put you into it. I'm going to suck you through your computer screen and put you in those situations, okay? You're going to tell me which one was right, which one was wrong. And now we're going to do this, okay? Let's do this. This is animals, by the way. We're still on animals. Okay. Animals. The first one. You're a vet. You went to school. You have that degree thing. You have that stupid diploma. You're gonna brag about it. Is that good? Keep that in mind. Bragging about diplomas veterinarian. Is it good? It's animal based. Okay, keep that in the back of your mind. That's A. B. You're a psycho fucking messed up serial killer guy and you like to kill animals. You're killing small animals. It's the first step to the serial killer. Did you not know this? Do you not watch those serial killer movies? It's the first step to being a serial killer. So, are you going to tell them about how you kill little kitties? Are you going to show them a dead cat? Are you going to offer them a dead cat? Is this what's going to happen? Is this what's going to happen? That is B. Is that right? I don't know. We're going to move on to C. <sighs> C. You're going to tell them that you're a cat person and you live with 50 freaking cats. Is it good? I don't know. How about you tell me? You tell me. Is it good? I don't know. 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 Do you guess the one about the veterinarian, do you want to boast about that? No, you're a prude boy. You're a prude boy if you boast about your little school. No school and public conversation. Shut the fuck up. No. Do you want to tell them that you live with 50 cats? No. No. You don't want them thinking that your house smells like shit. You don't want them thinking that your house smells like shit or cat piss. You're going to tell them that you kill cats. You're going to offer them the dead cat. Because you know what? That's a turn on. Major turn on. Mystery. Do you not like mystery? You don't like mystery? I have a thousand freaking movies behind me. Mystery is good. It's a good movie. It's a good movie. It's a good movie. It needs for a good movie. Okay. Woo! It's famous people. When you're meeting them, basic conversation. How are you going to start your conversation? Like, for example, this weekend I met Shane Dawson. Awesome Shane Dawson. He's amazing. So sweet. Love the guy. Absolutely love him. But, when you meet him, what's inappropriate to say to Shane Dawson? Are you going to go up to him and be like, I love you so much? No! So, what you're going to do when you go up to him is do what I did. I went up to him and I'm like, I just came in my pants. He told me I made his nipples hard. That's what you do when you meet Shane Dawson. You gotta do specifics. You gotta get specific people. You gotta get them the right person. You say the right thing to the right person, okay? Mm -hmm. If you met Obama, would you tell him that you came in your pants? No! You would tell him you did a great speech. If you go up to Obama and you're like, that speech was orgasmic. He's gonna get security on your ass. You're gonna live in Guam for the rest of your life. You don't want that. You don't want that. Let my list go. Okie dokie, it's upside down. Bad breath. That's gross. Ah. <sighs> no. Bad breath's gross. Bad breath's gross. Don't do that. No bad breath. Use a mint or something, bitch. Use a mint. Here's a big pet peeve of mine. Don't go out sick. Please, bitch. <sighs> Choking on my words. I'm getting closer to you. Oh, it's sweating. Like my Lady Gaga shirt. Okay. Don't go out when you're sick. How about just don't do it. It's great. You don't do it. You just don't do it. Okay? You just don't go out sick. You just don't. But whatever. You don't go out sick, it's just not cool, because you're gonna get other people sick. When other people get me sick, I get really mad. You know what? I get really mad, I kick an ass. I kick their ass, I beat their ass, I fuck them up. It's what I do. Look at this. Skinny, scrawny arm. I'm gonna fuck you up if you get me sick. How about that? How about that? How about that? Like, stay home if you're sick. Okay? If you're sick and you go out to a party and you see someone you wanna get with, or you wanna just dance around with, guess what? You're gonna puke on their face. Puking on their face is not attractive. No one likes puking on people's faces. That's not cool. No, you lose. Mm -mm. Okay. That's basically all I had except for another thing I wanted to show you. I just, I just popped in the world's number one turnoff. 
<laughs> retainers. Fuck no. Don't wear your retainer in public. You sound like a little boy who's choking on a piece of shit. You're gonna take that shit out. Ow, bitch, what the fuck. You're gonna leave it in case. Let your teeth shift. Let your teeth shift. Your orthodontist does not know. I know. Listen to me. Listen to Sharky. Don't wear your retainer. Don't wear them. Your teeth will be fine. Trust me. Trust me. Da. You'll wear them. And then they'll turn everyone off and you'll never get laid. Da -da 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 -da. I'm sweating. Oh my god, it's so hot down here. Okay, that's the end. I'm just gonna say that. Oh my god. Boom. Let's try that again. Oh god, dude. I got dust in my fucking eye. Oh, uh, you know what? Shit. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>